a time for tears as we bid farewell to a great man, NYPD detective Stephen McDonald. Thousands of officers and ordinary people lined Fifth Avenue outside St. Patrick's Cathedral to pay their respects as the hero made his final journey. Cardinal Timothy Dolan officiated. We're here to thank God, to thank God for Stephen's splendid life of love and service. Officers and firefighters also stood in tribute on overpasses as the funeral cortege made its way into the city, dozens of motorcycles leading the way. The bagpipes were still and only a solemn drumbeat and the peal of a bell could be heard as the NYPD pipe band escorted the hearse to the cathedral. Then as a lone piper played Amazing Grace, the coffin was carried inside. McDonald was the young patrolman shot three times in 1986 by a teenager who was stealing a bike in Central Park. He was left paralyzed for life, but he forgave the teen who shot him, and his courage and compassion in the years that followed inspired everyone. Be with the New York City Police Department. It's the best ever. He died of a heart attack on Tuesday, aged 59. His wife, Patty Ann, was pregnant when McDonald was shot. Their son, Connor, is now a police sergeant. They spoke at a wake yesterday. I mean this from the bottom of my heart. Thank you, thank you, thank you for everything that everyone has done for us. Not just this past week, but over the past 30 years. The most important thing that we can take away from my father is the fact is uh, his mission of uh, love and compassion. A moving goodbye to Stephen McDonald, a hero to the very end.